Thanks for tuning in and welcome to another video where we're going to show you how to set up some alerts and also how to monitor your client's symptoms, hoping that this will boost their engagement within their exercise program and also future appointments. Looking at our collection here, we have a handful of exercises that we might send to one of our clients. In the publish page, what we're able to do is we're able to give the program a name, decide who we're going to send this to, add any notes, and then if we want to set up client reporting. In order to do this, we click on the toggle, and then we're able to select from various health outcomes that we might choose regardless of the area of healthcare that we work in. Once we've chosen a health outcome, we can then use these filters on the right to decide when we're going to track this. If we were, for example, to choose that we want to track fatigue before the day has started, it might give us a nice baseline for how the person feels. Once we've done this, we can reuse any health outcomes that we want and change the filters on the right, allowing us to generate some really useful feedback for how our clients are responding to their exercise programs. Once we've done this, if we think that maybe this is a set of health outcomes that we want to use again in the future, then we can click on new preset. This is going to allow us to say these health outcomes with a meaningful name to speed up this process in the future. Once you've done that and clicked on save, then you will find them in the future within the drop down menu. So when you navigate onto the publish page and you want to send a program, you can very quickly, with a click of a button, have all of these health outcomes available for you to then assign to your client. If you want to add to this, you can set up some alerts. Looking at the program duration feature, we can toggle this, opening up all of these features. First of all, we can set an end date to this program. This could be the moment before the person has their next appointment, or maybe it could just be a date in the future that's going to allow us to intervene, maybe contact our client, make them feel cared for because we've called them and we're asking how they're getting on. Either way, you can choose a date that's right for you. And then when this program ends, you can choose what's going to happen. You might want to be alerted yourself, and this can act as a great reminder to contact your client and then ask how they're getting on. Alternatively, you might want your client to be contacted. This will allow your client to receive an email from Rehab Guru telling them their program has expired and encouraging them to contact their therapist. In fact, you can even customize the email that is then sent with this expiration. In order to do that, you can navigate to the account page and click on the customize filter here on the left. We've added this new feature called email customization, and it allows you to choose any of the emails that are going to be sent from your Rehab Guru account. If we choose this client program expired option, we can see the email that is going to be sent to our clients. And it says your program, the name of the program, expires at such a date. Please contact your therapist. However, we can add to this. It might be that you want to book a booking link to your calendar so that your clients can rebook. It might be that you want to ask them to complete a survey or a patient reported outcome measure. It might be that you want a link to your Google review or Facebook review pages. Hopefully you can see how you can customize this as you wish for all of your clients to boost engagement. Once you've done this and you've assigned the program, you're going to be able to view the person's feedback within the client's page. You can choose the person that you want and then click on view. Once you've done this, the reporting filter will show you any patient reported outcome measures that the client has completed and also the feedback that they've given to their exercise program. This feedback includes the date that they have completed the exercise program on. The bars illustrate compliance so you know whether they've done all of their exercises or not and the lines represent their health outcomes. Depending on how you've set up your tracking, you can just view this as an overview to see in general what trends are happening 
with your client's health. However, if you have asked for more specific detail about how they're responding to each exercise, simply click on one of these sessions and you'll get further detail. In this case, I've asked before the sessions even started here to be told about these health outcomes. I've also asked after the session to understand how they feel in a sense of fatigue. And then here are the health outcomes related to each of the exercises. Any comments will be in the middle and the parameters that you've set will be on the right. Hopefully this gives you tons of really useful data to engage with your clients again, whether you're speaking to them over the phone, whether you're contacting them via a telehealth appointment, or if they are face to face with you in the clinic. To give you an idea of what this will look like for your clients, here is a program that I've sent myself, and you can, as usual, look at the descriptions and the parameters, flick between the videos and the images, but the clients now have the ability to click on start session. Depending on what health outcomes you've set and how you've configured them, the clients can simply click on each health outcome telling you on this sliding scale how they're feeling. If they want to, they can add any other comments, but they don't have to. In this case, I've asked for feedback after every exercise. And so I have this submit feedback button that appears. And again, using these sliding scales, I can tell my clinician how I'm feeling. I can also alter the reps and sets that I've been able to do and add any comments if I want to. Once this is done, this data will be immediately available for the clinician to see. And this is also available for your clients to see within the Rehab Guru client app, allowing them to set reminders, allowing them to have telehealth consultations with you and allowing them to see the great feedback that they're giving you and the great improvement that they're making. Hopefully you find all these features really useful for boosting engagement in exercise programs as well as engagement in future appointments. Thanks so much for tuning in and have a great day.